strong. Mike, what about you? Uh, I've been in a relationship since last October. Uh, it's uh, and my girlfriend is significantly younger than me, uh, but it's worked out pretty well. She helps out with the business, and uh, she understands my lifestyle. And yeah, it's worked out pretty well. Do Wait, how old is she? Business yeah. and pleasure. What, what is significantly Ooh. younger? Do you she's mind She's twenty-four asking? years younger than me. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So I didn't know when I met her. She was like, "Yeah, I graduated college or graduated high school." Blah blah blah. And we met, I was hosting a bikini pageant in uh, Mexico, and she was one of the finalists. Okay. And she, uh, she did not, uh, I could just tell she wasn't, like, I, could, I thought she was the hottest girl there, but I knew she wasn't going to win because she, sure. had, she had a boob job and because they, those girls just don't do well in pageants. And also because uh, she did not, like, deal with bullshit from the fucking, uh, from the judges. So I was like, I know that this is going to work out. And she's yeah. from Arkansas. I'm from Texas. So it just kind of <laughs> worked out there. And, and she's, uh, yeah, she's been great since then. Cool. I will say this. I want to talk, because mm-hmm. I was talking about this before. She had uh, the uh, birth control mm-hmm. thing taken out. Mm-hmm. Totally oh. different, bro. Totally different. Something I want to talk different about. Like, yeah. Yeah, different part. Yeah, totally yeah, different. different. She had the birth Crazy. control thing taken out like uh, maybe uh, in June. Man, that, all that shit. I, before it was theoretical. I'm telling you right now, the shit is for real. The birth control thing makes, mm-hmm. bro. I mean, mm-hmm. it's just so, it's night and day. So, Which yeah, the, one? You keep going like this. The There's one right here. Uh, in, uh, in, inside the left. You want to feel it? <laughs> was it <laughs> next, <laughs> next phenon? I don't know what it was. I don't know. I saw them pull it out. Yeah. I was holding her hand yeah. when they pulled that fucking thing out of her yeah, like an alien. Yeah. It was all bleeding yeah. all over the Wait, so pro- when she was on birth control, she was one way after they got it got taken out her personality changed yeah in what so in what ways how was she before so, so, how was she so after? so before remember she's 24 years younger than me and so yeah. there's a there's a thing where like i'm i'm a u.s military there's also the part where i'm a u.s military officer and i run my own company mm. and so the way i communicate with my employees and the guys who were in my squadron was very different i'm very direct when i communicate i look at you i speak very loudly there's pauses in between the words and for her she's from arkansas and they just you know they talk some shit you know and when 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 she got the thing out, like the highs and lows just weren't there as much, which I've had with every relationship I've ever been in. But mm-hmm. with her I'd, afterwards, he was just she's just fucking fun now. I just can't even explain it. Mm-hmm. Ladies, I'm, I'm, I, before I was maybe 30, 20, 30 percent on this boat. I'm 100 percent on this boat. Get that fucking mm-hmm. thing taken out of your arm. For real. That Agreed. thing is crazy, bro. I can't believe how di- like it is totally. Di- and it wasn't just her. It was just I had a panel with eight girls on my show, uh, Access Vegas. And I said, how many of you guys have had birth control? All of them raised their hand. How many of you had it taken out? All of them raised their hand. And they're like, what's the difference? It's like, I took it out. I'm healthier. I'm hornier. Like, all this stuff happened when they took the, the birth control thing out. So that's the thing. Mm-hmm. I'd recommend that uh, that ring. You know what I'm talking about? Nuva ring? No, it's not. A, it's a ring. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's, not, uh, not natural cycles, is it? It's, yeah, it's, 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 it's essentially like a natural way to track your Yes. Um, uh-huh. your yeah, hormone it, it, it can track our hormone cycle. I got friends that have been doing it for years. It's, it's fucking great. Copper IUD? Uh, so mm. the, the problem is uh, inflammation. It, yeah, there's it, some it basically just causes inflammation. There's not a lot hormonal of hormonal though. It's, yeah, it's, it's not, not hormonal, but, but it can, it can actually grow into the cervix, and then you have to have it surgically removed, and then, and then you had, have problems having kids afterwards. Uh, yeah, I've had many friends and family members mm. that have um, not been able to have children after um, having. Did them. not know that. Yeah. Okay. Isn't there a new one that got, well, I think there's two things that recently got approved when it comes to birth control. There's one that's actually over the counter now Mm -hmm. that got approved, which is just a hormonal one. And then there's one called Smexy or something. Has anyone heard that? The Smexy one? Is that the, like, the gel one? It's like the, yeah, the gel. I yeah. think that's Mexico. Where do you put the gel? <laughs> up, up I don't there. know. Well, there are, there are there are certain things that you can do like pre-sex to mm. like act as birth control. They're not as um, as effective as mm. hormonal birth control, but okay, yeah. Okay, 